Hi folks and welcome back to Old School Studios. We are back at East 98th and we are working on the hole in the wall. So here's where I'm at. I have provided a slot and a slot and I got a, two pieces of angle iron and the angle iron is going to go up in that slot it's going to be tap conned and mortared in place and when I open up the other side there'll be another one on the other side so I'm making a lintel where there was no lintel so after cutting this I realized that I need to cut this drywall a little bit more across the top on this line right here so my piece of steel sits flat against the cinder block and I could get some tap cons and then I could mortar it in place so without further ado I'm going to cut that drywall and I'll be right back at you all right, so I trimmed out that drywall, and that little needs to go up to this line on both sides. So I'm going to get some shims and whack it up tight, and then mark it and drill holes and tap con it. And then I have mortar, and I'm going to shoot mortar underneath and underneath each one of these to make it a solid state. So let me go get my drill and bits, and uh, we'll get some holes drilled in the steel, and I could drill and tap con into the brick. Cinder block. Hell yeah. this back where I want it here and I have my hammer drill I let these shims through the cinder block and put blue tap cons. So, I need two hands for this and I'll be right back.
All right, one more right here. Oops. Let's go find the correct bit. This one right here. Alright, I'm gonna go find my drill. So, with my drill. Blue tap con. Like so, I got three more. I go get them there in the kitchen. This is all going to get filled with cement or a mortar, so I'm in really uh, this is basically holding it in place till my mortar gets set up. Alright. So I'm chipping away at this so when I get to the other side with the finished floor I don't have to deal with a whole lot of masonry. All the masonry is going to come on this side. And I just got to cut the, uh, the, the old fashioned drywall. It's like thicker than drywall. It's two layers of uh, looks like a uh, quarter inch and three eighths. It's harder than drywall. So I'm going to chisel away at this, try to get most of this down in here and then I can get the garbage cans and clean up the mess all in one swoop. Okay, be back at you in a flash working on this. It's exasperating. I am exhausted. Exhaustion is set in. Right, I'm going to get that flush with the floor because that's where I got my measurement for my overall height. So I got that little piece across the bottom. Because with this electric here, I can relocate it over to the side. Alright, we're getting there folks. Alright, so here's where I'm at for today. I'm calling it a day because I'm exasperated and I got an hour drive home. And uh, 
we will pick up with this tomorrow and uh, <laughs> tomorrow what my plan is is I'm gonna relocate this electric line and uh, chisel away at this threshold and get it to floor level <laughs> I did right here and I'll fill that with mortar nice and flush with mortar and uh, this this needs chiseled like here across here so this is sitting level in my two bys my two by tens go up nice on the side and posted little since the beginning of time all right folks thank you for watching old school studios this is part two i don't know how many parts are going to be in this series but look for part three thank you for watching old school studios please hit like and subscribe have a good day